Guys, today I will show you how to make a simple inverter circuit at home. As always first let's take a look to the circuit diagram. As you can see it is very simple circuit. Here goes input DC 12 volt and LED indicator with 1K resistor. 220 ohms resistor for limiting current to this IC. I here have used this CD4047 multivibrator IC for generating pulse frequency to drive the MOSFETs. And here variable resistor used to adjust frequency of pulse generated at output. And through these resistors it goes to gate of both MOSFETs. And here we need to connect a step down 12022 to 5 amperes transformer to get output AC voltage. So, the circuit is as simple as that. For the easy assembly of circuit, I ordered PCBs from JLCPCB, they provide 5 pieces of PCBs for just $2. You can visit JLCPCB.com and simply click on order now. Add the PCB gubber file. After upload you can see preview of the PCB. And choose quantity and choose color of the PCB by your choice from the available colors. And save to cart for checkout. Here I got the blue PCB and it looks awesome. So now let's place all the components on PCB according to the circuit diagram. I have provided both circuit diagram and PCB layouts if you would like to make it at home. Also I have provided the PCB gubber file to order quality PCB from JLCPCB. You can download all the files link is given in video description. Now let's solder all the components on PCB. Now our soldering is complete, so let's trim the excess leads of components. To clean the flux residue on PCB you can use isopropyl alcohol. Now our PCB looks nice and clean. Take any medium sized aluminium heatsink. And use the silicon pads to insulate MOSFETs on heatsink. And place irfz 4 n MOSFETs on pads. Use these plastic washers for screws. Also use these PCB spaces to allow some space between heatsink and PCB. Now mount and solder the PCB with MOSFETs. Insert the CD4047 IC in IC connector. Now it is all set. Connect 12012 transformer here. And 12 volt battery here. Use these alligator clip wires to connect battery. And use 12012 transformer of 2 to 5 amperes. And connect these 3 wires side in this connector. I will use this blub holder and solder on transformer AC side. To test the circuit I'll use this 100 watt blub. Also I'll use this lead acid 12 volt battery to power up this inverter circuit. If light doesn't turn on, use the screwdriver to adjust variable resistor. You can see now 100 watt blub is glowing perfectly. I will now also try the LED blub. You can see it also works perfectly without flickering. So, the circuit was very easy, and you can easily make it at home, and can be used to power up the small appliances. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. For more amazing projects, subscribe the channel, also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.